What's going on YouTube? My name is Vladimir Distin and welcome back to another yapping video. <laughs> There's something that I wanted to talk about that I have been putting off for a long time and it probably sounds more serious than it actually is. But the thing with this is that it has been bugging me for a while because I feel like I've been doing a disservice to myself. Let me explain. So for the past, maybe, I don't know, half a year, I've been contemplating and wondering why for the past four years, I haven't hit a thousand subscribers. Now, hear me out. Hear me out. I'm not saying that I, that I have to be or anything, but I just feel like for four years, I feel like I should be elsewhere. You know, I'm not content with where I'm at. And that doesn't mean I'm not happy doing what I do. But I do feel like for four years, I should be a little higher. You know what I mean? Uh, but what I realized is that I have this tendency of starting multiple games, as we've talked about before, and I don't finish all of them. <laughs> A good example the oldest example is resident evil 7 to be honest i didn't like that game i was so tired of the movement the movement is so trash the resident evil movement like the movement resident evil tend to be a little funky but in resident evil 7 specifically i hated it but anyways going back to the inconsistency and stuff the problem also is that i jump from drastically different genres you know i try to play horror games i try to play playthroughs like spider-man you know i then i do games like Sandra Banka that are totally different and the problem with this is that I attract people of those kinds of games you know you, you know you got the anime people you got the horror people you got the superhero people maybe and then when I post something that doesn't have to do with any of them it kind of like it just it, it does bad obviously right and so that tells YouTube hey even these people that normally watch him or that I subscribe to him are not watching his video so why the heck are we going to be pushing out his video therefore kills my momentum kills anything that i have going on there you know because i realized last year around this time when we were playing syndrome banca when i was on that long marathon of trying to complete syndrome banca i have seen the most i had seen a ton of growth that i haven't seen in a long time especially that consistent growth as well so i was like oh, holy crap like this is the way to go. And then I, what I do after that, I started playing Spider-Man. And that killed me. That killed my momentum. Now that's a problem, right? So then that's when I was like, okay. What if I start another channel? And now the thing is like, oh, well, that's a no-brainer. You know, visual novels, horror games, and other playthroughs like Spider-Man are very, very different, right? Some people might even argue visual novels are boring. Like, very boring. And I could totally understand that. And I see that, you know, like it's reading. Who plays reading games for fun you know i understand that i know it's not for everyone and it's a very very they're not very popular so that's also a big thing so i was like okay second channel but then i'm like why would i do that though i just i don't like the idea and i still kind of don't but i've kind of accepted it more because like i said i'm doing myself a disservice you know not playing games that i want to play and i'm saying i'm not saying i don't want to play visual novels but i do want to play visual novels the thing is, I want to play other games as well, and I'm not doing it because I'm focusing more on trying to build momentum, trying to build the community, and therefore, it makes the whole process a little less unenjoyable rather than if I have a second channel, I have my visual novel channel, I do both. Yeah, like, I'm going to probably be uploading a little less on the main or the first channel because, in my opinion, I, don't, I wouldn't consider any a main, but I would probably be uploading less on the visual novels naturally because you know i want to spend some time too on the second channel you know playing games like spider-man resident evil 4 like i've talked about in the community tab you know i really wanted to play too the new final fantasy game that came out well i guess the new one now is the 7 remake i think they remade it i'm not too sure correct me if i'm wrong but, but the one that they had released before that is uh fudge i can't even remember it has to do with the main protagonist being clyde if you know what i'm talking about you know what i'm talking about i could also show up an example right now as we're speaking or as i am speaking or as i would rather call it yapping <laughs> something about the idea of having another channel 
makes me feel some type of way because I feel like I'm one of those people that I'd rather have everything all in one place. You know, I don't know how the second channel is going to go. And that's also something that has me like, mm. but then I'm like, no, like just do it because you love it, you know? And I do love it. And I do love the visual novels. I do love recording. I love sharing the gaming experience with people. You know, I feel like whenever I play a game without sharing the experience with someone, and in this case, you guys, I feel kind of like I'm wasting my time because I feel like I could do something more with this, which is to me, sharing the gaming experience, the game experience with other people, you know? And I could do that on YouTube, you know, sharing the gameplay, sharing my stupid jokes, you know? and doing something out of it you know and i feel more fulfilled that way and with me just focusing on visual novels i don't feel as fulfilled because i'm putting off a want of mine which is to play those other games as well by just sticking the visual novels and focusing on the growth and like again i enjoy visual novels but i'm making myself miserable because i'm not enjoying the process as much because i'm worried i'm thinking about the growth and not much of the game as much you know and so i finally decided after after a lot of thinking that i wanted to create a second channel the second channel i'm not even gonna lie to you it's I, there's not gonna be a freaking it's not even gonna be a whole schedule set in stone you know i'm not gonna be like oh yeah like i guarantee two it is two it is because visual novels require significantly less freaking effort you know i could just skip most of the stuff because it's a whole lot of reading naturally and in a game like for example resident evil or spider-man i have to like okay you know this is happening the the interesting part which you know maybe a fighting scene or just a a cutscene in general you know and then i'm doing some tedious side missions i could cut that off you know and it's a little more thought it's a little more work and and it takes longer so i can't just be like oh yeah two and two and you gotta keep in mind i work a full-time job and i wake up early and i get at out like at 2 30 uh thankfully like i've talked about before i started working last so you know thank the higher power for that i am now able to upload more videos and take care of myself a little more because before i was overworking and i realized that i wasn't getting any richer you know and i was not doing what i love and i was just living the nine to five and in this case the nine to six because i was working extra hours and i was just not as happy i was not fulfilled i was not happy with what was going on huh look at that on my computer here uh so windows has like this little thing where it tells you like the day the weather alert and stuff it says pollen tomorrow and now i'm like holy crap this makes sense because today at work the, today's the 14th on oh, no, thursday today at work i was suffering from allergies like extremely bad here in the valley in Palm Springs, there's been heavy winds and there's been dust all over the place. And my nose has been like screaming for help. And my nose might even look a little red because I've been like the entire day because my nose has just been run, running. I took two freaking Zyrtec. I think that's how they're called. They're basically allergy pills. And uh, they did not do crap. I was suffering the entire day. <laughs> and it says pollen tomorrow. So it's going to be another day of this, of the nose rubbing and the nose running. I'm a, I'm a kill. I'm not going to do that, but boy. Oh, anyways, back to the topic at hand. Jesus Christ, what did I leave off? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, yeah, I was basically like not as happy, not as fulfilled because I was doing half of what I wanted to do. You know, it's gaming, yes, but I wanted to do other genres, you know. So another thing I want you guys to know and understand is that what I am going to do with the with the playthroughs that I already started on Vitamin D Stain, the new channel is going to be called Vitamin D. We're going to make it easier because I, I originally thought about putting vn on this channel vitamin d stain vn like visual novel you know vitamin d stain and then another channel like vitamin d plays or vitamin d stain you know but then i was like nah just vitamin d whatever uh this is how it looks like so when you look for it this is what you're looking for uh vitamin d please go subscribe if you're interested you know i'm gonna be playing horror games i'm gonna be playing games like spider-man i'm gonna be playing rpg games rpg horror you know focus more on that stuff basically play anything that i want and feel like and maybe whatever you guys want to see except visual novels visual novels is just going to be strictly on this channel starting now from now on moving forward just visual novels i'm going to focus on visual novels you know your turn to die is i guess a visual novel you know it's an rpg but it's also a visual novel because we're reading and uh yeah we're going to continue down there of course eventually i know there's like a final act uh but anyways on the other channel vitamin d 
we're going to be doing more of that. So if you're interested, please consider subscribing and checking it out. And if not, okay, cool, uh, whatever. I just wanted to talk about this because it was driving me crazy. And maybe it's one of those things that it's like, oh, it's a no-brainer or it shouldn't be bugging me that much. But it was because I, I just, I don't know what it is, but I'm just, I want everything all in one place. But the problem is I can't do that because I'm hurting myself. I'm hurting my own growth, you know, and I would just upload and record and play games thinking, oh, I just hope they like it. That's it. You know, I wasn't like, okay, I need a niche. I should focus on this. Like, no, I was just all over the place. <laughs> and while it's been fun and I've met some online, some good people online that have been extremely nice to me, very supportive of what I do. You guys know who you are. Um, and anybody else that watches and silently supports, I appreciate you too. But it doesn't mean I don't appreciate the people that are here now, but it just means I want to grow. That's all it is, you know, and I don't think there's anything wrong with that. But now, anything else that I wanted to say about vitamin D? Oh, yeah. I don't know if I said it already, but no, I did say it already. Yeah. All the games that I completed on vitamin D stain or I haven't completed on vitamin D stain, I'm going to complete on vitamin D. And what I am going to do since there is a collaborate feature on YouTube where you could like make a playlist on one channel and then collaborate with someone. I'm going to collaborate with myself. So it'll just look a little funky, I know, but it'll have like, for example, if I started Spider-Man 2 and there's three episodes out on vitamin D stain on vitamin D, I'm going to I'm going to put myself on the vitamin D stain playlist. So it's going to be vitamin D stain collaborating with vitamin D on vitamin D. The second channel, I'm going to continue the playthrough, you know, it's going to look a little funky just because it's going to be two different channels. But it's only going to be for the games that I started and have not completed, except Resident Evil 7. I'm not going to complete that game. I'm going to be honest with you. And I don't like having games started and not finishing. But honestly, I just I was playing it and trying to pretty much forced myself to finish it you know because i was like come on like you know we started it and you know games aren't cheap a, a lot of them aren't and they don't have to be expensive you know but the games that i had bought you know they aren't really the cheapest and i don't want it to go to waste and blah blah, blah blah or maybe i should give it a chance again but right now i don't feel like i want to and if someday in the future that changes you know i want to get curious or for some reason somebody told me something or i found something and i'm like okay i want to finish it then i'll finish it but i'm not going to finish it anytime soon to be honest with you because i just i wasn't crazy about it the the thing that kills me about resident evil 7 and this goes for a lot of resident evil games is the movement the movement is so annoying and it, it's very hard to get used to as well but anyways um that's all i wanted to say uh thank you for hearing me yap I appreciate it. Here's your chat, Yappuccino for today. Yappuccino on me. I appreciate you being here, listening and hearing me out and for supporting. And if you made it this far, thank you very much. And I hope you guys don't get too confused with this. I know for the games that I already started and I'm going to be collaborating with those two channels, I know it's going to be a little messy, a little weird, but bear with me. It's only going to be with the games that I started already on this channel. you know. And there's so many games to get through and so many games are so long too. So we're going to be on them for a while as well. Especially the visual novels. Don't get me started on those. We've talked about that before. But that's all I wanted to talk about for today. I'm going to Mexico this month on the 25th. And I'll be back on the 10th of April. And I just wanted to let you guys know before I did. Although there's a lot of time still. There's literally 11 days still. You know, but I just wanted to talk about it still. You know, and I'm going to keep talking about it till I go and return, you know. But when I return, I'm going to be working hard. You know, I'm going to I'm gonna be trying to be consistent and put a decent amount of videos out on both channels you know if i could do two and two that'd be perfect but honestly that is a lot of work so what's most likely going to happen is i'm going to do two visual novel episodes and one on the second channel which is any other game like i've talked about or if i feel like it i'll do one visual episode a week and then two on the second channel you know it just depends a lot how i feel too you know i'm not gonna lie to you and then i'm not gonna say oh yeah this is a schedule no no schedule we, we, we don't know what a schedule is in this channel we don't know what a schedule is there's no schedules here because i feel different different days and i want to play games different ways and different games on different days and i'm not gonna be like oh yeah i'm gonna do this this isn't like no 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 no. i'm gonna do whatever the heck i feel like it and if you're here for that great i appreciate you i'm, I'm glad you're here i really do appreciate you and i really i'm happy to have you here and it means the world to me you know and you would make 12 year old me extremely extremely happy <laughs> but i i'm not gonna 
put that on myself, you know, because I may want to be like, okay, I want to grind on the visual novel, or hey, I want to grind Spider Man today. I don't know. I'm not. I can't decide today and to the future and be like, okay, I'm going to do this, 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 because then there's going to be days where I'm going to be like, yeah, or maybe I'd, I'm not even going to post anything on the visual novel channel, you know? So, you know, it all depends. So if you're going to be following both accounts, thank you. You'll know more of what's happening if you're following both. And if you just want to do visual novel or just the vitamin D channel, they're both valid. I'm not going to egg on you on that for supporting me. Like that's stupid. Even if it's on one side, or if you don't support me either, that's also great. Like, it's fine, but, you know, the best way you're going to know what's going on is if you're following both. That's all I'm going to say. And if one tickles your pickle and the other one doesn't, that's completely fine. You know, but just know that it's not going to be super consistent, you know. But I will try to at least get a video a week on one of the channels, you know, and two on the other. I work a full-time job, and that's very draining, too, and I work outside. And especially during summer here in the Valley, holy crap, it gets hot as hell. It gets really hot, and it gets even more tiring, so... There probably will be a time where I don't even want to upload, you know. And so I hope you guys will bear with me. I hope you guys will join me. And if so, thank you very much. I appreciate it. And if you made it this far, thank you very much again. It really does mean the world to me. And I'll see you guys around. I'll keep you guys updated, of course. I am not sure when exactly I'll upload a video on vitamin D. But just know it'll be soon, you know. Uh, by the time you see this, the most recent video of Sandra Baca will be episode 31. Um, I'll, after you see this video, I'm probably already going to have uploaded the first video on vitamin D and I'm planning the, to start the channel. I think I'm going to continue on with, uh, what, what have we started? Probably one of the RPG horror games or one of the Spider-Man or Spider-Man 2. Or I was also thinking Eternites. I, Eternites looks promising as heck. You know, it looks fire. It looks really fire. It looks really, really fire. You know, but I also want to start Resident Evil 4. Oh my god, there's just so many games. I'm so excited to do this. You know, and I'm glad I came to this decision, you know, because now I, I could already imagine myself, you know, I'm gonna be playing all the games I want to play. I'm gonna feel more fulfilled with my YouTube thing, and it's gonna be great. We're gonna have a fun time, and I hope you guys will have a fun time as well. And yeah, I'm excited. I'm really excited. And also at the same time, like, ah, I wish I could keep it all in one video. But unfortunately, the thing is, and in my head, I was like, oh, if I focus on YouTube or if I focus on visual novels for X amount of time and I build an audience, then I could play whatever the heck I want. The thing is, I'm no Markiplier. I'm no Corey Kenshin. I'm no big YouTuber where I could just go and return whenever I want to. Or, or I guess I could do that. But what I'm trying to say essentially is I can't just play anything I want and not care about the algorithm. Because if I was at a point where I was happy with like my results in terms of like, for example, uh, views, you know, I wouldn't care if the algorithm is like, oh, we're not going to recommend you. But right now it's pretty crucial for my growth on YouTube, you know, to be consistent with one thing. Therefore is why I decided to launch the second channel. But OK, I'm done talking. This is probably way longer than it should have been. But I just I wanted to. Holy crap, this is really long. If you listen to this entire time of me yapping, thank you. Seriously, that's crazy. Uh, but that's it. That's all I got to say. That's all I got to say. I hope you guys will be willing to give it a shot, you know. And, I mean, the thing is, I started this channel on those types of games. You know, the horror games, the, the Let's Plays, the RPG games, all that stuff. And it seemed to have done pretty well as well, you know. It's just... I'm I'm trying to put two completely different things in all in one channel and it just doesn't work. I'm I'm too small to do that, you know. I'm not I'm not at a point where I'm like, oh yeah, I don't care if the algorithm messes me up. I care right now because I'm tiny. You know, nobody knows who vitamin D is. Anyways, with that being said, I'm gonna wrap it up there. Thank you so much for hearing me yap. I don't do many of those talk videos. <laughs> but when I do it's because I feel like it is important that I talk about certain things, you know. And anything that goes here doesn't necessarily mean it's more important than the other or not important at all or super important. But it's just one of those things to me where I'm like, okay, I feel like I should let y'all know. You know, I want to talk about this thing, you know. And this thing has bugged me and I found a solution, I think. And I hope it goes well, you know. And if not, it's okay, you know. Like, I'm in this because it's... It's fun. I love sharing game experiences with people and I like nerding out on it on the comment section, you know, and be like, oh, yeah, like this, 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 and that. Oh, you saw when this 
person did this, so this person crapped on this person, and like blah blah blah. You know, it's it's great. It's so fun. It's so fun. I love it. And when I'm not doing that, it feels sad. You know, because I'm not doing what I love. And I think you should do what you love if you can. You know, because if you're not doing what you love when you can, then why? What the heck is the point? You know, you're gonna you're gonna die someday. You're gonna look back as you're dying. You know, and you're seeing your memories as you're dying and you're gonna be like okay well i did this entire human experience and i didn't do what i love or i didn't do it enough or i wish i could have done this and i didn't do it i can't imagine how depressing that must feel realizing that you know i don't want to do that you know youtube has been a thing i wanted to do since i was 12 watching pewdiepie you know like you know watching people like markiplier cory kenshin you know, or Irwin Wilderman. That guy, he's basically the person that inspired me to do visual novels because he used to do a lot of visual novels. And a lot of those early, and a lot of those YouTubers did RPG games too for a long time before they started doing any of the bigger titles. But anyways, yeah, it's something that I love to do. And I'm really happy that I came to this decision because now it'll feel more fulfilling, it'll feel more rewarding. And maybe it'll help me grow a little better too. And I won't even be thinking about that now because I'll also just be enjoying this whole process more because I'm playing exactly what I want to play, you know, and I get to share it with you guys, you know, and I think that's what it's all about. Okay, for the fifth time, that's all I have to say. <laughs> I hope you guys will be joining me on the second channel. If not, that's cool. That's cool. But I'll see you guys around. You know, thank you for being here. Thank you for hearing me out. It really means the world to me. And I'll see you guys in the next video as always. You'll stay safe. And until next time, guys.